These are the B-Post quarter panels for the Jaguar E-Type fixed head coupe two-seater versions. Now there's three different versions of these quarter panels uh, for the two-seater fixed heads. This is uh, type one, as we call it, which is the very early version used on the early 3.8 series ones. Um, there are another two versions used on the later versions. Uh, always worth double checking because Jaguar had no consistency whatsoever. These panels here dominate what panel you have for the rear side casing, so it's quite important to get these right. But back to these panels, they're millboard, they cut on our CNC machine, so you've got all the fixing holes, etc. in them. They're also foamed, they're creased as well, that allows you to bend that round nice and easily. Then they have the metal strip on the top there. Uh, so you get a pair of them. This one here is the right hand um, quarter panel. Bends round, so that goes over the sill step as you go into the car there. That hole there is for the rear hatch door release. And this up here, which actually is on both of them, that is for the quarter panel pocket, uh, which we sell separately. The quarter panel pockets are always beige, uh, on the inside beige wall cloth like the headliner. They're sold separately. So you get a pair of those trimmed all the way around, like I say, with a metal bit there. Um, easy way of defining which ones you have if you're unsure is it's all really related to the cant rails. The E-Type fixed-head two-seaters had two different versions of cant rails. The very early ones, you didn't have a lower section of the cant rail, which was the part that went under the rear side window area. So if you don't have that lower cant rail area, then you need these type of quarter panels along with the Type 1 rear side casings.